Greetings, <laughs> RC Model Geeks! Greetings, <laughs> RC Model Geeks! <laughs> yeah. And welcome to part six! Uh -huh. See, I can remember which part we're on. I can't. I know. Mm. So, um, we've cleared the bench. Colin has OCD tidied up the bench. Yeah, all the tools are away. And we've got another bit of plan on there. And it's the wings! Yeah, there we go. Nice picture of the... So basically you build a top and a bottom wing over each half here. So this, this does the top side and the bottom wing as well on one side. And there is the other for, uh, for building. So leading edge here mm -hmm. on that one, leading edge here on this one. Hmm. So that's what we're going to be building next. Uh, it only has ailerons on the lower wings. Note, ailerons on lower wing only. Mm -hmm. Top wing is just a plain wing with no ailerons. Uh, yes. Yeah, so <laughs> oh, <laughs> mate. Uh, wings. You know what? I get I get bored after one panel. Yeah. I've got four. <laughs> oh well. Oh my god. Uh, we'll have to have a wing break. Yeah, we'll have to have a wing break. <laughs> yeah, we might do halfway through. Yeah. We'll have a wing break and do something like b uh, repair a radio or something. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Yeah, yeah, maybe we'll repair that radio down there. Yeah. That old 1950s radio. Yeah, it's nothing like repairing a valve radio. No. Oh, we haven't shown people that this was one that I um, restored. Oh, yeah. We're in the process of. Let's get this out quickly. Yeah. A bit of an aside. This is a uh, little radio, valve radio, mm -hmm. by the way. And it works. Awesome. Car to the best call today is one of John the Norwich fan. Still working on it, but got it working. Nice little radio. I said it's a valve radio, battery operated valve radio. Hmm. I'm going to play that too long, otherwise we'll get... It's a nice finish on the top there, isn't it? Yeah. Mm. There you go. So yeah, we might have a play around with that. When we bore with wings. Yeah. 90 volts and one and a half volts that takes. Oh right. There's quite a lot of batteries in there. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, amazing how many PP3s you can fit inside. Oh yes, definitely. So yeah, anyway, so uh, yeah, we're going to get on with the wing. We'll start laying it out and um, and sort of come back to you. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. So see you uh, in a bit when we've got something going. Yeah. See you soon. Uh, <laughs> right. Okay. We're uh, we've done one wing. Yeah. Well, one half of one wing. Yeah. <laughs> uh, pretty much. Uh, it's all together. Um, yeah, I mean that's the basics of uh, one wing done. We've got all the false ribs in, everything's together, servo bay uh, in the middle here, um, ready for the servo to be mounted on, ailerons cut out, pre-drilled with the centres of the holes for the hinges, and we spotted it through onto the main wing there as well. So that is all done. So hmm. that's the bottom wing done. Awesome. So we will get on with another one. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, we'll, I think we'll build a top wing, same side this time. Um, but yeah, it went together pretty easy. I added a couple of uh, little extra strengtheners where I thought it needed them. Um, um, wherever, down here, over in this corner. Yeah, just to give it a little bit more strength. Uh, added a, a little doubler here on this end rib because mm -hmm. it will tweak in when you shrink the covering. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and that's it. That's ready, pretty much, uh, to go. Uh, yeah, wicked. Anyway, postman's bin. Yes. <laughs> What's in the box? What's in the box? Uh, this is for the future, but uh, it's a little uh, regulator and water trap. Excellent. Yeah, and there's a bracket in there and a box of probably something in it, uh -huh. a box of bits. But that's for something that's coming in the post fairly soon. Yes, all will be revealed. <clears throat> yeah, I'm sure we'll do a video on it. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> yeah, uh, we've got some push rods 
Um, these are three mil push rods. They're nice and thick. Yeah. Um, we've got some three mil rose joints coming, um, and we're going to be using those on the cabanes, I think. Uh -huh. uh, mainly models that was from. Um, arrived fairly quick again. You've already seen a link to mainly models before. Mm -hmm. So that's that. Um, and then because of the rose joints we're using, I've got uh, a clockwise and anti-clockwise thread. Yep. Because uh, there's two different ones. Uh, right. We needed some um, left-hand thread dies. Yeah. So I've got a three, a four, a five, a six, and an eight mm -hmm. left-hand die. Right. Uh, there. Um... Yeah, I mean that was pretty cheap. I think it was six quid or something, something like that for those. Uh, That's four. good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and that was from um, Joe J O W nineteen ninety five on eBay. Yeah, he's got loads of cheap tools and stuff like that. There he is. So worth a worth a check out there. Mm -hmm. and that came fairly quickly as well. Came first class post actually. Which oh, is good. Good for him. Well done. Yeah, big thumbs up there. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, so um, we'll uh, we'll carry on. I don't know how long this video is now. Um, no, I haven't got a clue. No, nor have I. Nor have I. I haven't got a clue. Uh, so maybe uh, maybe we'll call this one uh, quits. Uh huh. And um, there'll be another video along soon. Yes. So it's goodbye from. Mayor Colin. And me. Yeah, Rob. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. Thanks and to our um, Patreon. Uh, Patreon, yeah. Um, I think we've got five now, Patreon supporters, something like that, five. So, yeah, it's uh, it's getting there. Yeah, cheers, uh, guys. Well, Tea and Biscuits is coming along quite oh, nicely. Oh, and Jamie Dodgers. Um, I can't remember the name of the last person. I'll have a look and um, I'll let you know on the next video. Okay. Okay, so anyway, goodbye from Mad Colin. And it's goodbye from Captain Rob. Bye. Cheers. <laughs> No, just come this way. It's too dark. In this way. That's fucking better. Still in the dark. We'll get a reflection off your glasses. So okay. anyway, Colin, what are you doing? Right. Right, okay. Here we are. We've only got an hour of video left. <laughs> okay. Good to one hour, Yeah. <laughs> Rob has purchased... <laughs> Rob's per purchased an XY table for our uh, little pillar drill here. Yeah, there it is. Uh, like a little milling attachment. Uh, you've got that way. Rob's got to tighten up the jib strips yet because we're a bit Ways wobbly. For everybody else in yeah. the world. And we can go this way. Look at that. So, for demonstration purposes, I'm going to do a square. Oh, fuck. So, first of all, we're going to plunge down. Come on then. In. Into our bit of wood. Like so. Go on, almost all asleep, aren't you? Oh, will be quiet. And then I'm going to lock the head off. Are you doing it today? Yeah, that's fine. Right. Like so. And then, there we go. And it's exploded. Yeah. If you wind it the wrong way, because you've got a rotation seat, don't you? And you really cut on one side. Tighten that up, Cole, before you are doing this. Yeah, I think this wants. We'll tighten it up then. Yeah. And I'll leave that when you do it. Yeah, yeah, but you stop it moving. Leave on adjusting. Just do it. I'll, I'll, I'll get on with it. I'll hold it. Right, you've got your name. Fucking hell. You've got a week. <laughs> Knobs are stiff. The story of my life. Should have put fucking oil on them. Yeah, I said to grease them up, didn't I? And here we have. Look at that. Well, you've almost done it, mate. Well Look at done. that. And just to clean it up. Yeah, tidy it up. Just now. touch on. Go the right way, obviously. <laughs> This is from years of using um, a milling machine, isn't it? Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, this skill. It's this, inbuilt, you know. This thing's back to front. Comes natural, doesn't it? Yeah, look at that. Yeah, that's all right. Once you've got the old, it's all right. Can you get a square drill? 
<laughs> Shut up, you made me go the wrong way then. No, I've got to go a bit deeper with that one. There we are, look. look I'm glad you set this up. Oh yeah. Sort of. Got this a tight. See why people buy CNC now, can't you? Yeah. Much better. Yeah, see that's cutting nice because you're cutting the right way. <coughs> you're claw cutting rather than climbing. There you go guys. Yeah. When that's fettled up, that's a nice square hole. There you go. That's how not to make a hole. Yeah. By editing then Colin Porter. 